first out here in the city of Delamo at Imperial CFS. Let me see if these guys respect the right to jump today. Forming a First Amendment audit. Why are you interrupting me? Why are you taking video here? Does it matter? No, I would like to know what you're doing. It's All right, so these two guys came out right at the end as we were walking away and started yelling at us, telling us if they ever find out who we are, that I guess they're going to do something about it, like uh, put a lawsuit or something like that. So pretty funny situation that they come out after the fact to uh, tell me they're going to sue me. I would be pretty interested to find out what they would actually try to do about this. It's none of your business, man. Go back to work. Well, you're sitting here taking in this direction. So what's wrong with that? I would like to know why you Have you ever used the camera and pointed it in a certain direction and taken a picture before? Have you ever done that or you, do you not? You guys never seen right, cameras well, before. Okay, let's, let's do it then. Let's do what then? You want to take a picture of me? Okay, so what are you doing here? None of your f***ing business. F*** right. off. Alright, let's call the police then. You're gonna be a crybaby and call the police for a photographer taking photos? For what reason? That's, that's all yeah, it's it's, it's none of your business. Hostile. It's none of your business and the police are gonna tell you the same thing. So stop being it's a little crybaby. Stop being a little whiny crybaby and and uh, threatening to call the cops, which is unnecessary. Hey, no, we're not trying to be hostile, we're just trying to... Yeah, oh, well, this guy just threatened to call the cops no, on me. This guy's threatening me to be a rat. He wants to be a rat. For you for a photographer, you, I'm not even breaking the law. What are you I'm doing? not even the breaking law. the law, what man. What are you doing? None of your business. It is my business. No, it's yeah. not your so business. I don't have to. I don't work for you. I don't have to explain nothing to you, man. Go so away. What are you doing here? None of your business. All right. Well, it's none of your business what I do in public, man. If I was on your property, I understand you have a problem, but I'm not on your property, so go away. Yeah, but you're taking pictures of our property. It doesn't matter. If I could see it, I could film it, man. It's part of the First Amendment, freedom of press. Anything I can see in public, I can film. Simple as that, man. Simple as that. There's no crime being committed here. There's no reason to call the cops. If you guys want to cower up and call the cops, then I'm that's on you. I just don't want you here. I don't care what you want. Do you control what people do in the street? Do you walk up and run, run to people in public and just tell them, I don't want you here, you got to go? Get the hell out of here, man. You, got, you, you sound very uneducated, man. Very uneducated. You should learn a little bit about, about our rights. You have the right to be here, yes. Okay. Yeah, and I have the right not to have to explain anything. I don't have to explain to you. They're going to tell them that over the phone, man. You guys are going to kick rocks and then you're going to lose sleep over this because you couldn't shut me down. It's not whatever, man. It's the truth. The cops are going to tell you to leave the photographer alone. He's not breaking the law. There it is, the sad walk of shame right here. He's 
guys are kicking rocks in a shameful manner. There it is. There's no reason we have to explain anything to them, especially them after them threatening us with with the uh, bully ass police, the biggest gang member in LA. They want to threaten us with gang members showing up to handle this, you know, so uh, if that's how they want to handle their business here at Imperial CFS, then that's the way they do it. You know, what can we do about that? If they want to make themselves look like a fool, they can make themselves look like a fool. Why are you being unprofessional, lady? I'm not being, I'm being unprofessional. Yeah, didn't you just flip them off? Yeah, yeah, oh, that's unprofessional, and you work for Ally Universal. You work for Ally Universal. We'll hear about this. Yeah, unprofessional guard flipping the flipping off the photographer. Flip, we got it on camera. We got it on camera. You're gonna be exposed. Ally Universal will hear about it. You barely have a job. Acting all unprofessional, you barely have a job, lady. Man, you're a rat too. Not only are you unprofessional, but you're a rat calling the police for a couple of photographers. Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here. Keep walking. That's a security is coming. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? We were filming you. No, I mean like right now. Later. So you guys recognize this douchebag? This is the guy that battered me the other day. He followed us down the street to another audit to go troll us. Later, douchebag. <laughs> Look at the douchebag in the back seat. Fucking <laughs> Uber. Look at the Uber in the back seat. <laughs> Oh, these guys are funny, man. You guys are funny like them too, or what? Well, I don't know. My brother told me to check out. Uh, my brother just said to check out where you guys are being. Why they're filming this side of the building? We're taking public photography. You guys gonna be cowards and come and batter us like that guy did, or what? No, I just want to try to find out. Ah, oh, man. I mean, if you guys say public photography, then who you know? Just, yeah, we're just out doing public photography, photography, but that douchebag actually came out and tried to steal my equipment out of my hands. Oh. So that's why he had words to say about me. Oh, I'm just. You know, it's but to find out why we're just trying to figure out why. Yeah, no, we're just doing public photography, man. That's right. it. Nothing to be concerned about, man. Right. Well, I mean, they're just concerned because you know, business is business. So. Right. Yeah, yeah right. but we're, you know, as long as we don't go on your property, everything should be good, right? Yeah, seems like it. Yeah. So you don't know, or it seems like it? Huh? So you don't know? Because you said seems like it. Well, I mean, common sense dictates as long as you don't go inside the property. You then be okay, common right? sense, you approach people with cameras? Uh, when so, the business is being filmed from the outside, yeah. You guys don't have cameras around your facility? Actually, believe it or not, we only have a couple facing the parking lot just because oh, okay. we've had theft in the past. So that's the only reason I guess the president got anxious is because we've had theft in the past, which is why they installed I don't think somebody's going to break into your facility carrying cameras, man. No. They might have something more useful <laughs> like, <laughs> nah, like a uh, screwdriver or something, you know? <laughs> believe it or not, we've had, we've had people in the past like go on the property with the camera, like a Chinese dude. Oh, yeah? Because uh, we do a lot of importing, so some of the designs are like uh, trademark and blueprints, and they've actually tried to get in with the camera hanging on there. Taking oh, okay. That's why it, when they see that, they're like, is it another case of that? What's going on? Oh, so yeah. They just no. told us to find out. Just out here in public, man. Just right, nothing to be about. concerned about. You know, let them know nothing to be concerned about. No terroristic threat <laughs> or. No, like I said, you know? when you've had things in the past happen, you just want to make sure. Yeah. No, right, everything's good, man. You guys have a good one. All right. All right, later.